so good. It's Sunday and it's a gorgeous day out and my husband is home early and I love being around my husband. I love spending time with him. Super fun guy. So I am headed there. Yay. And I still am looking for black heels and also I'm looking for a chair ottoman type situation for my new desk for my beauty room. So we're going to see what they have. And of course while I'm here, I'm going to always look at, well basically anything because I freaking love Marshalls. It's like a great store. So many cute Christmas sweaters. I love these silly Christmas sweaters and outfits. It's so cute. So the first thing I noticed is the word clearance. That is like my favorite. And I am looking for black heels. It's looking maybe like the clearance is summery shoes, which would make sense. But um, the black heels that I had were like this, only black, and I just cannot find them. I don't know where they are. And that would have been fine and perfect. I wanted something else, but I'm running out of time, so that would have worked. But I can't even find those. Well, look at these. It's cute. I do not need any more uh, shoe like that. But that's a no for that aisle. Let's see. Um, women's, I passed it. Girls dress. pretty shoe. I'm looking for something like literally $30 or less because that's the kind of girl I am. And if it was less than $30, I would be like the happiest girl. I would totally like something like this, but in black. And the price would have been good enough. Again, I'd prefer it to be 20, but Payless is no longer around. So this girl has to step up her game. <laughs> I love that shoe, by the way. Very cute. Um, I don't see anything like what I'm looking for. See a lot of cute things, but this could work. I think. I have feet problems, so the heel is good. Plus, I'm clumsy, to be honest. I'm not good in heels. The heel's good. I wonder if I would match my dress or not. I might actually grab it, and if I, it doesn't work with my dress, I'll just return it. I may have just found my shoe, guys. Let's see if they have my size. I am a perfect seven. Seven all the time. There it is. And it's Nine West. I really like the brand Nine West. How about y'all? Do you like it? pretty cute. My dress is very dressy, so I have no idea if this is dressy enough. This, if it isn't, is like what my daughter was looking for, I believe. So I got the shoes, and I'm hoping they work with my outfit. And look what I just found. These are literally like my favorite shoes. I got them before at JCPenney, and they're so cheesy, but they're literally like my favorite. But they broke really fast, so they have them in a lot of colors, too. Super cute, I love those. I should buy some, but they're $12.99 and I'm not trying to spend money right now. Oh, look at those. So while we're here, of course, I have to look at the makeup and the gift sets. And they have lots of cute things. You guys know my obsession with brushes. I really love a good brush. This is like the best time to buy stuff because they just have gift sets so you get more for your money. Guys, they have philosophy gift sets. This is a really nice brand. So of course we made it to the makeup section and they have this Two face. These colors are not, not right, but sorry for the noise. This blanket is like to die for. Like I feel like I need this in my life for after Christmas. Remember the part where I told you I was super into blankets? Yeah, I can't stop. It's crazy. $24.99. I feel like that's high for me. So I will pass because I really don't need blankets anyway, but these blankets are like so cute. You can really make a room too. If you just get a blanket and throw it on your couch, 
It just really makes the decor really cute. So much they done. That's so cute. I love when these have the little lids. And that is $14.99. That's a great gift idea. I never got too much into this right now at all. Like I have I have one thing actually, so I didn't get into it at all, actually, not even too much. But I find it to be very cute. I think I've told you guys before, I have a small house, so you know. I can't bring a ton of stuff in there, which is probably good because I like stuff. I am looking for another brush holder, and I like that. It's so cute, and it's $3.99. I have two brush holders similar to this, and then I had the one that I just got from BH Cosmetics. But my sister just gave me all those brushes, so I could use another one. The brush collection is like on point. There's so many brushes. Awesome. Oh, but this one's pretty cool and different. Looks like it could break though easily. I don't want things that are gonna break. So yeah, I really like that one, but I don't love the color. It's like a beigey color, and I would prefer a white, I think, in most cases. I do have a beige one like that, but I just, I don't know, I want white. And this one's really cute, brush it off. But I think I just found mine. Just a girl ready to conquer the world. Love it. And she's only $3.99. So I'll be taking her home today. I did like this one too. A girl should be two things, who and what she wants. Coco Chanel. Yes, girl, she should. Oh, this blue is nice too. I have blues in my house, but I like to have white things to be honest so that I could add pops of color when I get tired of the color I have or when I get anxious because white and neutral just really calms me and keeps me like my anxiety lower so I found myself in the Christmas aisle which is typical for me I told you guys that we really love Christmas so it's pretty crazy but I will admit we really don't need anything um, again because our house is small <laughs> so every inch is pretty much covered oh but I do need a wreath because there's this hole in my wall, my mom and I will say it, that when we see an area that like looks like it needs something on the wall, we immediately think it's a hole and we need to fill it. <laughs> and I wanted to fill it with a wreath. And I do like this one. And for $14.99, I might do it. I have a gift card again <laughs> to spend that I got from work when you're on time for work for a whole month they give you a certain amount of points for being on time and then you can redeem it as a gift card so i did that i'm also looking for a ring holder like that maybe but i oh i like this one it's so christmasy though so i don't know that that's what i want because i want to use it all year round but i need a couple of those I don't see any more around here. I've got my stuff. I've got my shoes finally, and hopefully they work. So I'm gonna go home and try it on and go from there, and hopefully the shoe hunt is over. Hopefully I can maybe even run it up to the seamstress and get it um, altered because I'm running out of time and I feel guilty now already asking them to do the alterations so quickly. After a long day of cleaning and organizing and Christmas decorating, we have decided to go into the hot tub. <laughs> we may or may not have a truly or Corona or two, and it's perfect. We are going out. The boys were watching football, and sadly, the Pats lost. God bless America. Here's a little sneak peek of our backyard. Sunday night football. We normally decorate for Christmas out here, and it's like super Christmassy, but we chose to not do that so we can try to enjoy the month of December. And we are starting out with, like I said, this uh, hot tub time machine situation. <laughs> Hey guys, this is Vlogmas Day 9, and I am leaving the um, alterationist. I had my dress fitted for the Christmas party that's coming up, and now I'm going to head to Target and pick up an online order for a gift, and try to run in and squeeze in another errand or two, and then pick up my son. Another long day, but um, we're making it, and I have tomorrow off, so that's super helpful, and here we go. 
so I came in here to get the pickup of the online order and I found myself shopping and I got some things. But I also um, realize I'm running really close on time and I have no business being here, so I have to hurry. Got the kid and the oh, kid. The kid wants Chick fil A. We came to the Chick fil A near our house and it's different. It's been remodeled and it looks like a bank. <laughs> they are serious business around here and they do it with a smile. Thank you, my pleasure. <laughs> so we got our Chick-fil-A. We both got milkshakes. I haven't had Chick-fil-A in a really long time. I've been being good, trying not to eat fast food. I have a sick obsession with fried fast food. Like I really, really love it. But um, obviously it's super bad for you. So I've been so doing really good about not having it and like a long, long time. But I had a free coupon for a free eight piece or a sandwich. So I chose eight piece and I couldn't resist the shake. So he loves to get Chick-fil-A after school, but I tell him no a lot because Chick-fil-A is like mad expensive. Do you also agree? Like I really love it, but it's expensive. But anyways, that's what we just did. These little things are pretty magical. Kind of remembering why everybody likes it so much, but so good. I'm not gonna get used to it. This is definitely the season where we're just eating whatever we want. Whoops! My mom is over here, and she is hard at work there, doing Christmas decorations over there. She's building little critters. These are critters that we got from last Christmas on Christmas clearance. So we're like super cheap. But like, look how cute this is. It's a little Shih Tzu. So cute. It's so tedious. There's a little uh, unicorn and a schnauzer like this guy. <laughs> That's how the Shih Tzu will look. And we even have a Rudolph here that you can't see, but he must be really small because it's a really tiny box. But my mom's amazing. She always does all these little things and does this tedious work here, putting these together. She's always a busy lady. <laughs> so, you guys, I'm so excited because look what came in the mail today. It is the Jeffree Star Mystery Box. And I've been waiting on it. I ordered it on Thanksgiving and... I didn't know if it was coming. I didn't know what was going on. I never got confirmations. There was all kinds of tea with this one. And so I want to go ahead and get right into it. I'm dying to rip open into it and see what it's all about. How about y'all? I bet you are. Cause I don't know anything about these mystery boxes, these Jeffree Star mystery boxes. I know nothing. I am a newbie here, like I've said many times before. And um, I just was excited to order one. I don't have any Jeffree Star products yet, so super exciting. I also got today from Target these little glasses that are merry and bright. And I also got these glasses for my husband that says he sees you when you're drinking. They're so super cute. And so I basically am dying to pour myself a glass of a Truly and open this box. How about y'all? Do you wanna see that? So go ahead and grab yourselves a drink as well. Water, whatever, you soda. Let's go ahead and do an unboxing. Crack open a Truly. There's only like five calories or 5% alcohol. I don't think there's only five calories. That's a lot. <laughs> this is 100 calories. <laughs> And so satisfying. It's like an ASMR, that noise. Oh no, I went overboard. <laughs> Tasty. Very refreshing. So I hope you got your drink because we are ready to unbox this Jeffree Star mystery box. Got my drink, I got my kid. He's happy and excited to see what's in here. And we didn't get his drink. We we'll get reason. <laughs> it's that. All right, we're back in business again. He got his drink, I've got my drink. And we are ready to spill the tea. 
Okay, so I'm not a huge like makeup um, you know, connoisseur as in I don't have a lot of makeup, I don't know what it's all about. I know that I love it, I know that I've always loved it, but I don't have a huge collection. My collection is growing very quickly though, I will say that. So I've always known about Jeffree Star. I follow him on um, Snapchat and he um, came out with these mystery boxes and I was dying to get my hands on one. It was Thanksgiving and I was able to magically order it with no big deal. It was perfect. It Well, pretty perfect. It went through pretty well. But <laughs> here's the thing. There was problems later. And um, with no shade to Jeffree because I don't, I, like I said, I don't know how this really works, but I do know that these launches seem to go pretty wild and they sell out fast. And I work um, with coupons and glitches. So I definitely understand the whole process of when you buy stuff, you know, this type of thing happens. But um, it was like the, the site was glitching. It was uh, hard to order. My order went through, which I was so happy and excited. I got a mini box and I got a mirror, a mini mystery box, and then I got a large mystery box and um, two separate orders. I only was able to get a confirmation for one order and then the other one I didn't know. So I have no idea if this is the mini or if this is the big one. My guess is the big one. It's pretty good size. I mean, I just really have no idea. I emailed customer service and never found out that way either. So anyways, um, I'm just ready to get into it. I'm excited. It feels heavy. And this and and the anticipation is making it worse, right? <laughs> so, anyways, let's go ahead and get right in. What do you think is gonna be in here? Um, Christmas related stuff because the box is like has snow flocks, snowflakes. And stuff. <laughs> yeah, this is super cute Christmas box. And his um, fifth anniversary edition items came out at the same time. It was um. It was like an anniversary launch. I didn't get any of those because I was getting this. Oh, and by the way, the larger box was $60 and the smaller boxes were 20. And then there's a box in between, a medium box that was 40 that I didn't order. Um, I was mostly interested in getting the mini and the larger because the price points were, you know, good. And um, there was a little thing where they said that there would be a special edition cosmetic item and that's where the tea is in, um, in in every single mini box, I believe. And then it turned out that people were receiving um, their boxes and they weren't getting any special uh, edition cosmetic item. And there were stickers, which stickers are, apparently the stickers are really beautiful and were handmade, but people were <laughs> mad about it apparently. So Chance is back and now he has a candy cane. <laughs> Welcome to being a mother. <laughs> so anyways. The bottom line is that people were getting the stickers and I heard the stickers are really nice. I haven't seen, I've only seen one review for a mini box. I don't even remember her showing the stickers, but anyhow, apparently they were custom made, but they were not a custom cosmetic, like special edition cosmetic item. So of course people were upset. Apparently Jeffrey was upset that people were upset because um, you know they were custom made and his artists made those stickers, so he was disappointed that people were like talking, you know, about it. But um, he went ahead and apparently had a little bit of a rant. I don't know, I didn't see it, and then he deleted it. And then after that, he decided to dun -dun -dun -dun, refund everybody's mini box. So I got the mini box for free. So to me, it was worth the drama. <laughs> Because if it's free, it's for me. Well, not always, but sometimes. So anyways, let's see if this is the uh, the large box or the mini. This is a mystery box. I can't say it enough, guys, that they're so much fun. Oh, they're so And it already, yeah, it is some pretty packaging. It already looks so cool. There's the stickers that they're talking about. And you know what? Those are pretty cool. Those are really nice. They look like, like tattoos. I wonder if they, no, they're definitely stickers. And I think they're really cool. I mean, I will say, yeah, if I thought I was getting a, a, a custom holiday item um, cosmetic, I would probably be disappointed. But since I know, like, I'm, I'm not disappointed. These are cute. I love them. We're gonna definitely find somewhere to stick them. So they have this tissue paper, and it's actually super colorful. Look at all those colorfuls we have, or the colorfuls. <laughs> look at all those colors. And look at the crown. The packaging is so great. And I know you guys have heard me say it before that 
I'm a sucker for packaging and obviously we all know that it doesn't matter what the package is, it matters the product. However, the packaging is the icing on the cake and I like it. And the first thing I'm seeing is this Jeffree Star Liquid Frost. This is Heat Wave and let's see, Liquid Highlighter. Let's go ahead and open her up. Ooh, she is uh, something. Oh my. Very, very dark. That's what she is. <laughs> I'd be interested to see what, how this goes on and what this is like. Okay, so that is it. It is super dark and I have no idea how I would use this, but it is very pretty and uh, Jeffree Star, y'all. So, I opened it up. Would have gone with your cheetah outfit. Cheetah outfit, they would have. We just have to wear that again. <laughs> Next Halloween movie. <laughs> okay. More paper. I'm trying to avoid opening this for some reason because I just feel like I want to save it for last. I'm I'm sure this is a large box, so. Mm -mm. The mini only has two items in it. Yeah. So exactly. So that's not the mini. So the next thing I see is the Velour Liquid Lipstick. Ooh, and look at how cute it has a little um, stocking. It is in the color. Is that the color of Velour? Mm. Oh, maybe it's a, um, maybe it's, it has a question mark. So maybe it's a mystery is what that whole thing is. Mm -hmm. Let's check it out. Ooh, it is a super red. beautiful red. That is so pretty. In the shade Santa Baby. Just kidding. I made it up. I have no idea. It just has a super cute little, um, stocking with a question mark. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's pretty. Perfect for the holiday season. It's like you planned it that way or something. And then the next one is the Mermaid Blood. I think I've seen this one. Let me check it out. I don't remember. Is it blue? And it, it is. sure as heck is. <laughs> Not sure when and how I'll ever wear that, but that is pretty cool. And it, the packaging is everything, I'm telling you. Look at that. That's wild. I don't see myself wearing that, but it's part of my collection. So that was fun. Two liquid lipsticks. I believe the liquid lipsticks are $18 or more. So that right now we have two of those and we have this highlighter. Um, so I don't know how much these things are. I'll put them in the comments or I mean, I'll, I'll do something. I'll let you know somehow. <laughs> Description. And then let's take a peek inside this. It is Hardy, the Blue Blood, something or other. Because again, I don't know. Y'all are probably like cringing watching this, knowing that I don't know. It's like a makeup palette. Makeup palette. Ooh, guys, it, this palette is beautiful. This is. I wanted the conspiracy palette so badly, but it sold out within seconds. And this already reminds me of what the Ooh, packaging. I like that. Even though it's not like the packaging, but the shape is. Looks like a coffin. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is really pretty. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Check it out. Now, this makes me think of being in the ocean. And sure enough, there's ocean uh, ocean theme. Yep, it's definitely ocean theme. Very pretty, very cool thing to have in my collection. So yeah, we have four products and definitely sure that this is the larger box and I'm excited with it. It's not actually something I would have just run out and chosen and purchased myself, to be completely honest. I would have probably not chosen any of these except maybe this, but I'm so happy to have it. I, I like it and it was worth the thrill, to be honest. And let me know what, what you think. Do you think that it was worth it? Do you think that you'll do mystery boxes from Jeffree Star in the future? I mean, do you, what do you think about Jeffree Star, Jeffree Star Cosmetics, his brand? Like, go ahead and tell me in the comments what you think. But thank you for joining Vlogmas day number nine. And um, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.